copies all. You guys are approved in 2008 yellow and blue. We've currently got to pit on a bunch of insurgents in a compound, so uh, we're not going to engage them. The uh, task force one twelve QRF is going to move out from this area into that location and uh, engage these guys. Uh, what I'm going to do is once you guys get a bit closer is to have the Reaper lay this and uh, you guys capture that target area. We've got pit on a guy with a big, massive gun. Kandahar province, southern Afghanistan, the birthplace of the Taliban. It's 54,000 square kilometers of brutal insurgency, conflicting agendas, tribal rivalry, and blood feuds. This is the Canadian Forces area of operation. We wear it, and every day we drive deeper into the furnace of enemy country. It's one hell of a rough road. Fifteen to twenty, left to right. Hold left hand side of target. On. And buddy's got a shovel. Could be a farmer. On the road? Why not? Because it's the road, man. Could be a real shitty farmer, like constantly puzzled, you know. He's in the village asking buddy why my crops are lousy. You know it's hard to say, hey buddy. You can't grow like anything on a road. Will you shut the fuck up? Bad move. He's got a shell casing shaped like a 122. Orange deck cord sticking out of the nose. 390 Alpha 66. I have pit. Positive idea. One time's in searching. Time of contact 1028 local. 66, this is 390 Alpha. Over. 390 Alpha 66. Sit rep. One time's insurgent, gray man jams. Black headdress holding on 22 millimeter shell casing with orange dead cord emanating from the top. Emanating? Coming out of the top. And now he's placing the projectile into the hole. Well, on route Hyena, 650 meters to the north, northwest of Great Quebec, Quebec 41768134. 39 Alpha acknowledged. He stands back up, engage. Stand by. Three nine are alpha send. One time's insurgent engage in center mass. No motion. In Greek, Quebec, Quebec four one seven six eight one three four. Moving RV extraction. In Greek, Quebec, Quebec four one nine nine eight two two six. Three nine 
Commander Alpha, Roger that, 6-6. Six, six. One times insurgent VSA, we are pushing higher assets to confirm. 6-6, six, six, Roger, X filling now. 3-9er Alpha, Roger. Your ride's en route. 3-1 Charlie, this is 3-9er. Move now. 3-1 Charlie, we're on the move. We'll pick him up in 10 miles. One times insurgent KIA at grid, Quebec, Quebec, 4176 8134. Stretch the road 50 meters to the to the left. 31 Charlie, this is 66. What's your ETA? 6631 Charlie. We're about three to four mics the other side of the hill. 31 Charlie, this is 66. Advise you hold your position. Do not cross the hill. I say again, do not cross the hill. We got something weird on the road. Can I have a look? Wait out. 6631 Charlie. Good copy. Hey, can you get the coyote on the patch just 10 meters left of that culvert? Put around in it. What do you think? It's probably nothing. Hey, can you put around in the patch next to it? Could be just a bad patch of road. Yeah, what if you're wrong? When have I ever been wrong? My sister? Yeah, that was bad. Hickey, just for fun, chamber up a Rufus. Line up on that patch dead ahead of us. Let's see what an incendiary does.
are being effectively engaged. X filling now. Over. Three nine or Alpha, Roger out. Hey, we got a tick. We got troops in contact. Three one Charlie. Three nine or Alpha. Do you acknowledge last from six six? Three one Charlie, Roger that. Moving out now. Six six negative. Do not crest the hill. The road is filled with IEDs. You're the target. Can you circle the ridge? Get us on the backside. Three one Charlie, Roger, but it's two zero two five mics at best. And a break, break. Six six three nine or Alpha. What's the force size? Six six two zero to two five hostiles. I'm seeking strong point. Wait out. They're still on us! Fuck! Oh, fucker! They got us cut off! We need to find a strong point! I got a village! 6-6, six, six, we're moving into great field. We'll strong point from there. Wait out. Zero ASAP. You're on with zero, man. Zero, this is three nine or alpha. I've got troops in contact. Four size two five insurgents request fast air. Over. Three nine or alpha. This is zero. Roger that. We'll see what we got in the air. Over. Attack P. What lines be flying right now? Two ship, but they're not in range, sir. Get them there. Push them hard. Okay. Fires. Get my piss off grid. Roger that. Six six. This is three nine or alpha. Convoys on route and zero's pushing fast air, but you're gonna have to hang in there. Six six. Acknowledge. Over. We gotta find another point of interest! <laughs> 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 Basta di da gawa di matra pshel ti slash kishnar bolz da na kort ya bolz bas bas Sit rep, please. 6-6. Send sit rep, over. 3-9 or Alpha, 6-6. 3-9 or Alpha, send. 6-6, six, six, we're holed up inside compound at Grid Travis. Quebec, Quebec. 413-3-8921. Quebec, Quebec, 413-3-8921. We have a section plus of insurgents encircling compound. We need QRF extraction for Fort Pax. ASA fucking P. We got an elder with crazy eyes. He's, uh, 
He's asking us inside. I'm moving in. We'll shot point from there. Over. Did he say crazy eyes? Yeah. Can I get a description of the elder? Six six. This is zero. Describe the press. Six six. Did you not hear me? We need traffic extraction now. It's important. Six six. I say again. Describe the friendly. Over. Six six. Elder is about uh, I don't know. He's half gone old. Weird eyes. Different colors. Break, break, zero, they're jammed here. We gotta get them out. Three nine to Alpha, we're pushing. We'll advise. Fuck. <sighs> Let's move in, come on. Let's move in. I got it. Clear. I got it, Clear. Everybody take a corner. Three nine to Alpha, six six, looking for status on that ride home. 6639 or Alpha, QRF is 20 mics out, and you are danger close for artillery. You're gonna have to hunker down. We'll get you out of there ASAP. 66, Roger, out. We're on our own. Oh, they, they can't get anything to us? Not for a while. Okay, guys, let's arm up. Grenade. I need a grenade. I got one. Here. Z, Z. Yeah, okay. Z, Z. What do you think they're doing? Same as us, getting ready. You see anything? They got ready to recoil us. Oh, great. Everybody okay? Good. Yeah, I'm good. You? What's he doing? I don't know. They killed him. Gents, it's been a privilege. Likewise. Kill every fucker that comes through those doors. I'll do that. Taliban? No Taliban. Where's the Bala? Where's the? We're safe. Whoa, whoa, the Shailan is the Shailan is the. You trust him? Let's gear up. Let's go. Torde Paman. Hamacha Mushasa, the. The Hamacha Mushasa. Three nine off for six six. We're clearing the village. Moving around it. We're pointing grid four zero one two eight 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 three. Three nine are alpha acknowledged. RV Quebec Quebec four zero one two eight 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 three. Over. Zero. This is three nine are alpha six six coming home. Over. Zero acknowledge. Calf. 
You might as well be on Mars as in Afghanistan. We're out in the middle of the desert, surrounded by a forest of razor wire. It's a coalition force from over 45 different nations. Two-thirds of the soldiers deployed here never even see the country. They just see blast walls, defects, Tim Hortons. Nobody even knows how many people are on this base. 35, 45, 60,000. It's here, inside the wire, that we organize everything that goes on outside the wire. Half the time we got it wrong, but that means half the time we got it right. It's a vast organism that consumes 14 metric tons of food a day and shits into a lake that fills the air with 30% fecal matter. In calf, you breathe your own shit. I'm building a road, gentlemen. I'm building a big fucking road and it is going like a dagger into the heart of the enemy and it is fucking him up. And every morning he wakes up and I'm standing there, I punch him right in his fucking face. <laughs> now we've never been this deep into the heart of Panjway, but Hannah Road is in there and she is in there to stay. And they don't like it because we're fucking with their freedom of movement. So they're going after our dump trucks and our gravel trucks and our workers. What are you saying? I'm saying I've lost 36 civilians in the last four months and this bullshit has got to stop. And I'm gonna need a little help from you. General, I'm just one man. You're Bashir Dawood Khan, BDK. You're one man with a militia. And I'm your partner in peace. So I need your eyes and your ears. And I need you and your son to be at our little dedication ceremony. And how many clicks there, Shorty? 15, sir. 15 clicks of hardtop into the horn. Your presence there would be very meaningful. Hyena Road is a gift to all Afghans. It would be an honor for my father and I to attend your ceremony. Out fucking standing. Thank you, General. Thank you, sir. Look at that little prick. He's like Caligula. It'd be a hell of a lot easier to get hyena built if that prick would stop breathing. Yeah, right there, you're right. Look, I'm gonna hop a flight. I wanna get out to Spur, run down a lead on an elder. Tell Armstrong to call him from the FOB. Yeah, you don't wanna hang out with me? Oh, you know there is nothing I'd rather do, mm -hmm. but the future of Western civilization depends on my ass getting out to Spur. <sighs> Alexander the Great marched into this graveyard about 2,500 years ago. Easy to march in, hard to march out, his words. He and his mother wrote to each other all the time. And one day he got a letter from her saying, what the hell? You conquered most of the known world in like a day and a half. What are you doing bogged down in Afghanistan? He grabbed a bag and shoveled it full of dirt and had it sent back to Greece with a message to his mother. Take this dirt and dump it around the palace. See what happens. Look George, 6 one taking fire, left 10 o'clock, 300 meters, breaking right. Tank down, 3 and 1, back. Tank down, friend, all the time, top 7, up to the diner. Rope gun, target, 10 o'clock, shake down, 3 and 0, flight, stage track left. Ready, engage. Shake down, 3-0, target is neutralized. Roger, moving the rope. 
So Alexander's mother spread the dirt all around the palace. Later that night, a couple of attendants showed up to make sure she was all right. One says, go ahead, after you. And the other one says, no, after you. And the first one says, no, I insist. And the second one says, don't you tell me what to do. And they both pull their swords and they go at it till they kill each other. Alexander's mother watched all this and wrote a note to him saying, okay, okay, now I get it. And he wrote back saying, yeah, even the dirt is hostile. In Afghanistan, dogs fight dogs, birds fight birds, men kill men. Mind if I join you? Not at all, Warren. Please. Hey, I got an update from the engineer on that stretch of hyena from yesterday. They cleared eight IEDs and all. Something went wrong with the last one. The guy lost his leg above the knee. They airlifted him to Landstall. I think we need to talk. Hey, uh, hi, Jen. Sorry to interrupt here. Ryan, I'm Pete Mitchell, one of the effects guys at Brigade. I don't mean to wreck your meal, but you mind if I have a word with you? Sure. Catch up to you later. I was in the talk when you guys had that engagement and had you Baba. You were fucking lucky. Come all the way out here to tell me that? Nope. No, I came out here because, and I could be way out of line here, but, you know, manifestly, you and Jen got a little something going. On behalf of the entire battle group, I'd just like to express our collective fucking jealousy. <laughs> <laughs> you got a girl? Yep. Woman of my dreams back home. She know what you do? My wife? No. She thinks I work inside the wire, and I'm gonna leave it that way. Better sleep easy at night. Tell me something. How much do you know about Pastor and Wally? Well, whatever's in the handbook, you know, it's, uh, it's tribal code, it's old. Oh, yeah. And so old, they look upon Islam as a kind of recent add-on. What are those? The dates are local. They help you ship. <laughs> <laughs> the code has got a bunch of, uh, well, they call them pillars. And one of them is pana, which means protection, more or less. So when that elder invited you into his home, he gave you pana. No harm could come to you. So I owe him, you mean? Well, he did it for Allah. He didn't do it for you, but you're still breathing, so that'd be your call. This elder, he speak any English? No, just a couple words. You have any marks about him, any scars? No, but he had weird eyes. Weird how? His left eye was brown and his right eye was deep blue. Hmm. So who is this guy? Why do you, uh, why do you give me this, Pana? That's what I want to know. I got a patrol going back into the village in the morning. I'd really like it if you'd come along with me, help me ID the guy. Yeah, sure, I'll be there. 0900. All right. All right. I'll see you in the morning. Yeah.
Okay, I'm gonna say something. I'll say it for both of us, it's gonna be shitty. It's gotta be said. Fuck me. You know that I am completely crazy about you and Cyprus was... Cyprus was perfect. We're perfect. But we can't keep doing this, we both know that. If we get caught, I'm gonna get cashier. This is my career. Mm. It's mine too. I know, this is what I'm saying. When we rotate home, and we'll see. But right now, while we're here, it's gotta stop. So this is it? I think it has to be. Hmm. This is like fucking Armageddon. Oh, no. You know, there is nothing that I would rather do than climb over there and fraternize the shit out of you. Mm. Mm. You can't tell me in one sentence and say something like that in the next. Newly turned dirt, don't step on them. If you didn't drop it, don't pick it up. Try to stay at least five body lengths between the next man and the patrol. When we get in the village, you're gonna see women dressed in bags. Please don't stare at them. I know you've probably seen that in Toronto and Paris, but you haven't seen it here. Here, those bags are like magnets for your eyes. If you get caught staring at them, it's gonna fuck shit up for us. Quick lot, tourniquet, Bandage. I don't know if they use any of that. Ma'am, if it has to be used, it won't be you using it. job it is a great honor to meet elders such as yourself today i meet you so it's a good day but i was hoping to meet another elder in this village he insists that i'm the only elder and there is no other strange because someone told me there was another important man who lived in this village, but I forget his name. But this person said you couldn't forget him because he had two different colored eyes. You can see the women without their bags. Get down. Get down. Sorry, sir. I think you know who I mean. Shabba. 
He says he's a ghost. Even ghosts have to live somewhere. Ein Wum, Khone Kardora. Shabah pi Gandahar. Han Mavi Shabah, Kulu Gandahar. He says most of them live in Kandahar city. The carpets, they are dusty. The entire country is dusty. <laughs> Come on, let's have some tea. Step into my office. How are you doing, Pete? How's your family? How's your time? It's good. And how's yours? Have you heard from Kabul? When will we see him? Soon, inshallah. <clears throat> You're frowning. I thought you were crazy, but I was wrong, and I don't like to be wrong. My cousin says maybe it is him. In K City? He thinks so. Why is he back? If it's even him. But the eyes. If it is him, do you think you can get me in to see him? My uncle has arranged it for tomorrow. You tell him I'm going to bring along another guy a master sniper with a battle group. Well, another thing, it's not relational. Related. Related, yes. I'm hearing something about an attack. In K-City? Soon. That's all I know. As soon as I find out more, I will tell you. Okay. How are you? Do you need anything? No, I'm good. You always say you're good. I'm Afghan. Alhamdulillah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, listen, I got you... Uh, I got you some of that shampoo. What? <laughs> some of that hand cream you guys are so crazy about. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. This is great. You're welcome, my friend. It's my favorite. <laughs> Guys, listen up. This is straight hey, from the geez. brass. Guys, listen. All right. No more fraternizing with goats, you bunch of goat fuckers. Okay, listen up. All four debts are on tonight. All ops are observing report, except for you, Travis. You guys are on that bed in Hyena where that fucking tree is, so keep your eyes peeled. I've been seconded to Intel for the day, so I'm heading into K-City. Wolfie is going to step up. Whoa. Yeah, nice. Whoa. Whoa. All right, I got some bad news. They grabbed a couple guys from 10th Mountain Dog Company. What? Yeah. I don't know the details, but there was an ID of some sort, and Natalie's grabbed two of them. Are they alive? Yeah. You, you can blow me up with an IED. Shoot you with an AK, me fucking run me over with a blast! I'm fucking fine with that. But you do not let me get taken alive by these fucking medievalists. You good? What exactly do they do to you? It's unspeakable. You com logs, fill them out. What do you mean? Hey. Unspeakable means we don't fucking speak about it. place together, I'd come back, bring Joey camping. Camping? Yeah. In Kandahar. <clears throat> Why the fuck not? Ah, uh, number two's fully offloaded. Good to go. 
Three nine or Alpha. This is six six Bravo. Ready for extraction over. Let's go. Wolf. Beautiful morning. It's been for two hours. How long until the convoy? Should be on the move, five, ten mics, maybe. These A and A dudes. You trust these guys? With my life. It's their war, we're just along for the ride. Hey, Walid. Huh? What's he got going on the tunes? Leave got it. You shitting me? Yeah. Come on, put it out for all to hear. Yeah. Whiskey, we're falling in over. Roger that golf nighter whiskey, join in. Whiskey, we're breaking off. Thanks for the tow. Pete, anywhere here? Yeah. Who is that guy? He's called the Cleaner. He's the bravest man I've ever known. My greatest ally. He works for us, but can't be seen with us, if you know what I mean. His family's up in Kabul. He hasn't seen them or slept in the same bed for more than three nights running in the last two years. Why is he doing it? Love a country? Honestly, don't know. Can't just be for the money we pay him. Assalamu alaikum. Assalamu alaikum. Study message. Study message. Study message. Study 
Salut, ma c'est pas Khairi. Khairi, Khairati. 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 He says his name is Muhammad. Yeah, of course it is. This bread looks very good. My friend Ryan. We have been friends, we have known each other, and loved each other for many, many years. And you helped my friend in the village of Haji Baba. And I would like to repay you for that kindness. Now, you must need something, perhaps new prayer rugs for your mosque. I would like to help you. <laughs> How much is that? I have no idea. This is for your village. That has to see the Kali departed. He says only a fool accepts a gift without knowing what it's for. There was a legendary warrior, Mujahideen, in the Jihad against the Soviets. He was called the Lion of the Desert. He says he's heard of this man. The word is that he's back. He's once again Mujahid. Have you heard anything about these rumors? Ta che oridili. May I ask where you're from? Um, he says his village is called Abdullah Jan. So you're a Pakistani? No, to Pakistani. I've been a Pakistani for many years, a Muslim for 1,400, and a Pashtun for 5,000. I understand. If you hear anything about the lion, I would greatly appreciate it. Kamu does mere pahakla che she wauri del, zibadir khushalasan. Sayyidan no bas vladan darsa. So he's Pakistani? No. No, that was just a kind of test. Abdullah Jan is just the ruins of some village across the border from Spin Boldak. Nobody's really lived there for a couple hundred years, least of all him. So he's not just some guy from a village? No, he's not. He's a lion of the desert. That's what his people call him. The Russians, they called him the ghost because they couldn't kill him. They shot him four times, they blew him up twice. And each time, <clears throat> these guys would get him up over the mountains and into the Red Cross tents in Pakistan. And they'd get him stitched up, and he'd be back out there blowing Russians out of the sky. We just met a very big gun. It's like a Rommel or a Pat. This guy beat the Red Army, and he was a kid when he did it. When the Russians pulled out, he cut a deal with the Taliban. I'm going back to my grape fields. I don't want any part of your stupid civil war. Just leave me alone. Which they did. It was kind of weird, because generally speaking, the Talis went after anybody who stood against them. But him, for some reason, they just left him alone. Oh, yeah. So now he's back. He's back. I gotta figure out why. A guy like him with his influence, he could probably...
We have multiple bombers, vehicle borne and coordinated. Reporting civilian casualties, multiple SIP KIA, city center. We got a VV IED, Southwest Kandahar City, multiple casualties. And air reports taking fire at Route 1 and Alpha 75. Must hit the engine block. Pizza, where's the convoy? We lost the convoy. Zero Golf Niner Whiskey, uh, I have contact over. Zero acknowledged. Yeah, Golf Niner Whiskey, we have contact at Grid Quebec Romeo 23212 Niner. We have no milk no casualties. I have mobility kill over. Zero, Roger. Be advised, we have reports of multiple SPV IDs in vicinity of police headquarters. More to follow. Golf Niner Whiskey sent. Yeah, it looks like the tallies are at it again. It's a shit storm out there. I advise you try and exit city. Move to Camp Nathan Smith. Ride this one out. Golf Niner Whiskey will go out. There's another explosion. Let's go. We're gonna have to move, head north. God damn, we can't get the radio. Forget the radio, we'll use my inviter. Let's go! We gotta move! I'm gonna have to blow it. Wally? Yeah. Come, come here. Behind the car. Yeah. Frag out! Mitchell, grab Wally, punch up to that corner, cover my six. Roger, stay with me. Clear. Dick. Let's go. They're moving on the fucking rooftops. Clear, let's go. RPG! You good? Yeah, good. Can you shoot? Me? Fuck no, I'm Intel. Geo Golf Niner Whiskey, I have hit a multiple hostiles 40 meters east of last position, engaging. Wait out. Zero, Roger. Move it! Cavalry! Target one o'clock! Target down! Mitchell, come up to me! Move it! Go, 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 go! Hold up. I need you to punch left down that alleyway. I'll cover you. You good? Yeah, good to go. Stand by. Go! Clear. Clear. This is bad. You piss with the dick you got. Move it. Changing mags, cover me. Got right. Okay. Moving. Push up, nine o'clock. Shoot him. I don't shoot kids. Clear. Clear. Over. Oh, it's my guy. It's my guy. It's the cleaner. Go, 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 go. Shit, hey! I heard the gunfire! Came looking for you! We
We got lucky! Fuck yeah! Zero, this is Golf Niner with you. We're heading in. Zero, acknowledge. Whoa, that was balls out, flat out, fucking insanity. The five suicide bombers, rack RPG, 17 dead, 37 wounded. I gotta get a copy. Do we know what they were after? Yeah, police headquarters. We just got caught up in it, and that is Kandahar karma, baby. That's what that is. And I gotta say, you handle your rifle like you got ice in your veins. Well, those Sally's were using AKs, which is a great weapon if you're in a phone booth. <laughs> You work the city a lot? A fair bit, yeah. You got a weird job. <laughs> yeah. And you and you don't? Me? No. No, everybody knows the rules. You pick up an AK, an RPG, you're gonna hear about it. There's no gray area. Well, except back home where they think what you do is a little too, I don't know, premeditated. But my shit, hearts and minds, they lap that stuff up. It's got a moral ring to it, even if it's mostly just PR. You believe that? These people here, they got no use for what we have on offer. They don't want Justin Bieber or Tom Jefferson or our fucking pornography. They just want our money and a little bit of stability. So how do we win? There is no winning. It's just an end state, and that's gonna get laid down by foreign policy, not by us. You're a cynical man. Not about this country, I'm not. Not about these people. Me neither. And I gotta believe that if I put a $6 round, just one bullet in the right place, I could change everything. You may be right. You gonna stick around, Spur? No, I'm gonna hop a flight. Should grab my gear, I'll be in touch. I'll be around. Don't say anything. Just listen. I know our situation. I know it doesn't make sense. But you need to hear this from me. I love you. Right down to the bone, right down to the goddamn fucking marrow. You need to know that. Ditto. All of it. Hedgy, what are you doing? Cleaning the chairs. It's not your job. Well, whose job is it? Well, it's nobody's. This is why you have dirty chairs. <sighs> I need some tea. Come on. But why would he even agree to a meeting if he has absolutely nothing to say? Maybe he just wants the coalition to know that he's back. Yeah, maybe. But for what? We need to know who's in that village. Can you get into the Tashkira registry, find out who lives there? I have an uncle. He works in the governor's palace. God, how many uncles do you have? Many. <laughs> Tell me, what do you think of my hair? I've been using the shampoo. It looks silky smooth and very manageable. Mm, and my hands? Mm, soft, like a baby's bum. <laughs> You're the best. <laughs> need a favor. I'm looking at a village. It's this grid marker. Any event in the last time, I say the last six months. Morning, Pete. I know I should go through Armstrong, but I don't even actually know what I'm looking for. I don't feel like doing a whole workup just on a hunch. You want to visualize it? Anything with eyes, yeah. I'll let you know.
Anything useful? Maybe. What do I owe you? Take your beer allotment at the end of the month. Only get two, same as you. And I'll take them both. All right, they're yours. <laughs> you can clear all this shit off. Thanks, Joey. Oh, yeah, and uh, one of these days, I'm gonna spool up a fire mission and train my triple seven on your backside. Hey, Hachi, what you got for me? Oh, it's bad. It's Bashers. You kidding me? BDK owns that land, sure. It's in the record. Okay, listen, can you uh, get out to Spur tomorrow? Yes, no problem. You're at the gate if anyone asks you. Just a contract. You're working on a school or, I don't know, a fucking kite factory or something. <laughs> okay. Take care, my friend. Have you had any tenderness in your breasts or nausea or just the spotting? No, just the spotting. I'm really managing my cycle. I haven't had my period in six months, but I don't know, maybe I missed a pill or maybe I'm just being paranoid. Yeah. If we find something, what do we do? You know I'm supposed to report it. Well, I'm asking you not to. Heather is a friend, okay? Oh my. I miss them. Hang on. to go back because this job was pretty early in the road but yeah the debts i'm sure between 15 and 20 tallies moving across the field because of the force size they didn't engage company command requested the grid they called it in artillery beat the shit out of it there was some fast air in there as well right yeah i believe so yeah two a10s and they destroyed the field that's what warthogs do well see this matters because as it turns out the field is owned by bashi.com bdk the BDK leases the field to the farmer, who's basically, he's like a slave, right? The farmer works the field, then at the end of the poppy season, he's got to hand over 5,000 USD. Whatever he gets on top of that, he gets to keep, which is probably like 800 bucks, somewhere around the national average. Now, in this particular case, the tallies go running around the field, ISAP blows the shit out of it, 
and the crop is ruined. And now, well, the farmer, he's got less than Adam before the apple. Well, BDK shows up and goes, hello, where's my 5,000 USD? And the farmer says, well, uh, the crop was ruined, you know? No fault of my own. And BDK says, I don't give a shit. I'm evil. I will have my $5,000. And you have X amount of time to come up with it. Wow, oh, this guy sounds like Tony Soprano. Yeah, but without the therapist. Yeah, we Afghans, we're not very big on therapy. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so why are we looking at this farmer? His name is Abdul Malik. His father's name is Haji Malik. Lion of the desert. His father is the ghost. Holy shit. Now we think this is why the ghost has returned, to protect the honor of his family. And there's some bad history between BDK and the ghost. And I don't want things to go haywire, because I want the ghost. I want him to work with us. Because he could be a powerful ally for what we're trying to achieve down here. Maybe we'll actually get hyena built. So where do I fit in? Well, we think the date for payment is close, yeah? Yes. Two, three days kind of thing. So I need eyes on that village. I need to know about the comings and goings, the who, the what, all that kind of thing. All right. I got my snipers spread all over the area of operation, but I could redeploy, rotate the debts, two days on, two days off sort of thing, starting the night. Outstanding. <laughs> you ever try a date? No, thank you. Baby, please don't go. Check. You seen anything, Tank? I got it. All right, take a break. Roger. Hey, but is this something you want to tell me? Perry Como in the combat zone. It was on shuffle. Unacceptable. Completely inappropriate. I've been thinking about what you said about changing everything, you know, with one bullet. 
You really believe that? Yeah, I believe that. I'm here, aren't I? <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Look at this. Okay, what the fuck is this? <laughs> <laughs> I'm a terrible dancer. You're an unbelievably bad dancer. <laughs> but I'm a great shot. And I've always been. Ever since I was a kid. It might have been irresponsible to put a weapon in my hand, but people would get hunting licenses. They didn't even have a gun just so that I could hunt on their behalf. I used to shoot hard to shoot game, put food on people's tables when times were hard. Right. Sir, Captain Bowman wants to see you both. We're on. Three Niner Alpha, this is 6-6 six, six Bravo. 6-6 six, six Bravo, 3-9 Alpha, send, over. 6-6 six, six Bravo, we got a convoy heading our way, over. 3-9 Alpha, describe the convoy. 6-6 six, six Bravo, three white Suburbans, coming in fast, looks like they're up armored, over. 3-9 Niner Alpha, what's happening in the village? 6-6 six, six Bravo, all is quiet, over. They're not ready, they got no, god damn it. What's going on here? I don't know yet. Get everyone up. Roger. Holy shit. 6-6 six, six, Bravo, we got two VIPs exiting the vehicle. First 40s, black hair, bad dye job, BD little eyes. Can he confirm VIP is BDK? 6-6 six, six, Bravo, 3-9 or Alpha, is VIP BDK? Can you confirm? 6-6 six, six, Bravo confirming. VIP, call sign Bravo, Delta Kilo. Second Civ, Hamid Walid Khan. Call sign Hotel Whiskey Kilo. 3 Niner Alpha, this is 6 6 Bravo. We've got Taliban counting four. He's got tallies with him? A guy like BDK plays both sides of the fence. 6 6 Bravo, 3 Niner Alpha, do you have clearance? Are they carrying weapons? Wednesdays, Fridays, he's with us. Tuesdays, Thursdays, he's with the tallies. And on days off, they're both running narcotics. 6 6 Bravo. Negative. No weapons, but they're in costume, black turbans. Black man jams. These guys are not even trying to hide who they are, over. We have hostile action against civilians. 3-9 or Alpha, clarify hostile action. They're taking kids, little girls. 3-9 or Alpha, do you have imminent threat? Over. 6-6 six, six, Bravo, negative. But they are grabbing little girls and dragging them to their trucks. <coughs> what is it? Authorized to engage, I am getting ready to take the shot. No, I'm stepping in. 6-6 six, six, Bravo, this is Golf Niner Whiskey. Sit tight, over. The fuck? Take them down! Unless they pull our weapons, we can't get involved. 6-6 six, six, Bravo, I can intervene. Golf Niner Whiskey, negative. Unless you see a weapon, do not intervene. 6-6 six, six, Bravo, they are taking little kids. Golf Niner Whiskey, sit tight. 6-6 six, six, Bravo, clarify. Are you fucking kidding me? Golf Niner Whiskey, unless you see a weapon, do not engage. We gotta do something. Your guys will stand down. Jesus Christ. Settle down, Warren. Why didn't you over it? Because it's an intel op, it's their call, it's a rules of engagement, you know that! It's a fucking crime! Hey, we need to talk. Ah, uh, you know what, we're good, we're good. Hey, Mitchell, Mitchell, what are those girls, like eight, ten years old? Huh? Are we just stand there? What's gonna happen to them, huh? They're gonna be sold, that's what's gonna happen. BDK will hand them over to the tallies, the tallies will put them on the market, whatever they get above five, they're gonna keep, but BDK will get is $5,000, and then, I don't know, they're gonna end up in some shitty marriage in Dubai or worse are gonna end up sucking dick in some brothel outside of Fort McMurray. You know this and we don't intervene? We didn't intervene because we didn't have imminent threat. Those are the rules of engagement. I had to make that call. 
And we didn't intervene because BDK is protected by a roof, on top of which is a great big fucking sign that reads CIA. He's their asset. Now, you want to bring down our general and fuck up the entire battle group? Be my guest. Go ahead, shoot him. What kind of fucking war are we fighting here? Oh, come on. It's not one war. It's a whole bunch of different wars. And mine, it's like a 3D chess game. Half the time, I don't even know who the fuck I'm playing against. We're not hey, playing hey, games hey. here. No, we're not. But we're not here so kids can fly kites either. Then what the fuck are we doing here? We are rolling back the clock. And we are stacking the deck. So this time, the complete fucking crazies don't win. Hadji, did you get all of that? Yes, the relay was clear. He's going to have to react. He will make Badal. OK, Badal is another one of those tribal pillars. It's there. Come on, sit down. Sit down. Badal basically means, like, uh, revenge or... It's like an eye for an eye kind of thing. It's more about honor. If the leader of the family cannot restore honor to them, then he must leave forever. So the ghost has no choice. He must act. Now here's the thing. BDK served under the ghost in the war against the Russians. The story goes that a Russian chopper went down and BDK ass-raped one of the pilots. And as punishment, the ghost embarrassed him in front of the rest of the Muj. So you see, but that continues. Now, BDK is a bad guy, and he needs to be brought down. Now, we can't do it, but the ghost can. To do that, we got to boost the stature of the ghost. And we're going to start by inviting the ghost to the ceremony for Hyena Road. Put them together, but that is possible. I'm also going to offer up the safe house. If they meet on Hyena Road, it's political. If they meet at the safe house, it's personal. Either way, there's going to be fireworks. Okay, there's a flight heading back to Calf in about 10, 11 miles. I'm gonna hop on it. Now, I need you to set up a meeting with the ghost. We'll do it at the safe house. And I need your team to scope out security at the ceremony site and at the safe house. Ryan. Ryan. Don't think I don't feel for those girls, because I do. And we'll do what we can to find them. But right now, in the bigger picture, we need the ghost. Shishi? Sabah? No? Khabar about it. Whoa, 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 what's it? 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 What's it?
Travis said you were looking for me. Yeah. Hey, look, I'm sorry. I lost my shit. But you know me. And you know that most of the time I'm proud about what we do here and I'm proud about how we go about doing it, but those are kids. And if we can't help them, what's the point of doing all this? I don't have an answer for that. And for what it's worth, I agree with you, but that's not um, what I wanted to see you about. Uh, do you mind just closing the door? Uh, have a seat. I just have to show you something. What's this? Uh, that's our baby. It was... Cyprus, I guess. <laughs> it's one of the most beautiful things I've ever seen. <laughs> the most beautiful thing. This kind of changes things, doesn't it? Yeah, yeah, it changes everything. I think that you know, in terms of the brass, we're going to be okay because it happened while we were on leave, but we've got to, you know, figure out what we're going to do. Figure out what we're going to do? We're going to have a baby. Is that what you want? Yeah, of course that's what I want. More than anything. Okay, good. I'm glad. <laughs> Uh, you know, you're making me crazy. <laughs> yeah, no, I'm making myself crazy. Uh, <laughs> what did you think I'd think? I don't know. I just was, um... I was nervous. We didn't... leave things very well. <laughs> come here. Come here. Come here. Hey. We're gonna have a baby. <laughs> mm. oh. Oh. oh, you're sure it's mine? <laughs> Niner attack on base. Cox, another IED hit out on Hyena. One KIA. Guy out of Kabul, father of how many, Shorty? Five, sir. Five. Fuck. <sighs> Fighting these pricks is like nailing jello to the wall. I cannot keep losing civilians if we're gonna get Hyena built. And if we're gonna prevail down there. Hyena's got to go through. I got to get out there, get on the ground, I got to get my Leopard 2s rolling, and I got to blow them fuckers out of their beds. I got to find their weapons caches, I got to fuck with their command and control, and I cannot do that bouncing around goddamn helicopters. Now, that's the kinetic imperative, Pete. So I'm going to need a little help from you non-kinetic types. I need you effects guys to go in there and work your magic. Understood, sir. And we are working on it. My Afghan guys tell me the BDK's behind all of this shit. The more the security situation deteriorates, the more money he's making out of all the gravel trucks and all the other stuff he's into us for. Fucking horrible little man. If he was out of the picture getting the hyena through, it'd be a hell of a lot easier. He got knocked off his perch, I would not weep. Understood, sir. I hear the ghost back. Yes, sir. Is he a threat? Just the opposite. I think he could be a powerful ally. No, I don't care how you do it. Just make sure my civilians aren't getting hit every time they drive a fucking truck down there. Understood, sir. Thanks, Pete. Kaji, what the fuck are you doing? Uh, what? You can't see out of these things. There's nothing to see. No, not the way they are, no. Okay. Get in touch with the goats. The meeting's on. You have approval. It's always better to ask for forgiveness than permission. You know that. <laughs> we'll meet him at the safe house.
This house is a key feature. It's our asset, a safe house. We'll set up our OP here at the summit of the Saddle Back Ridge, and that'll give us clear line of sight to both sides of the hill. Here at the safe house, and here where the ceremony's gonna take place. What's the range? It's comfortable. 1150, 750 meters, both sides of the hill. But what about extraction? Well, Lexville, down the backside, through the grape fields, and get picked up on Route Hyena. How's this house gonna play? That's unknown. There's an offer out to the ghosts in BDK to show. Intel thinks they'll show up either at the safe house or at the ceremony. So we need eyes on both. All right, this is a tricky op, so I'll take lead. Wolf, you'll stand this one down. All right, let's gear up. I would like to thank you for meeting with me. He says the honor is mine. عجب هذا جزء بيأخذ يكور كناسهم ذا وقت ذي يكور تديرت لم رات لم تبغي ليش ذا كور ذي شاو؟ says I'm surprised to be here. I used to come to this house many times. He's asking you, do you know who used to own this house? Mula Omar. Mula Omarum ما يخبر غرنا ذا جزء ذا سخويس ذا لستر جي فكش بايلا ولا. He saved his ears, but he lost his eye. What does that mean? Same, same. Same, same what? Same, 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 same. If you ever need to use this house for whatever reason, it's yours. There was an event in Panjaway the other day, the village of Haji Baba. Two little girls were taken out of the arms of their father. And he says, why have you come to me? Because the little girls were taken by Bashir Daud Khan. Bashir Daud Khan be walidi. My general is a compassionate man. He's a student of Pashtun Wali. And he would like to help you, to help all Afghans, to help the village of Haji Baba. Zma general to Pashtun Wali shagirde. Haga ghwari chi tasu sara, ghananu sara, Haji Baba kali sara, marasta wakari. And he would be very honored if you would accept this gift. 5,000 U.S. dollars. He would also be honored if you would attend the ceremony for Hyena Road. He's saying, why me? I'm a simple great farmer. He understands this. But your presence would do him a great honor as an elder of the region. Who else will be there? Bashir Daud Khan. Peter, the Turtazada Bashir, Nazar de Dirk Shnewal Sakhapejanam. I have known this man Bashir since he was a boy. He brought great dishonor to our cause, and he was punished by my own hands. Thank your general for his kindness, and it will be my honor to attend. He says that chicken hates you. Yeah, Hedge, it's me. Yeah. I'm watching him walk up the side of a mountain. Yeah, he says he's going to show up, but I got the feeling he's got something up his sleeve. So I need you to get your eyes and ears out there, see what you can learn, okay? Yeah. Wa alaikum salam. Okay, let's get our gear. We'll go.
Whoa. Local meat? Heavenly Father, please protect those little girls. Watch over them and bring them home. Listen, I'm not sure I was entirely clear about all this, so I, I want to spell it out. I'd like it very much if uh, you could marry me, Captain Bowman. I would also like that very much, Warrant Officer Sanders. I gotta go. <laughs> We're heading out. I'm, I, I gotta get up. Oh, why don't I um, help you with that, kid? <laughs> oh, <I'm> crazy. <laughs> Fucking terrifying. <laughs> Hey, Jen. Hey. Hey. So how do you think this is going to play out? Oh, hard to say. A lot of variables. If the plan holds, we're golden. Anything shifts, who knows? Hey, we got 99 or attack on route, man. OK, buddy, here we go. General's on his way. You were down at the ceremony site? Yeah, on my way here. Usual motley crew, goats everywhere, shit all over the goddamn place. You know what I'd like to see? I'd like to see this country host the Olympics. That would be awesome. A 6'6", six, six, three niner alpha, sit rep. 3-9 and Alpha 6-6, six, six, good visual, clear line of sight, both sides, over. 3-9 and Alpha, roger. Six six nine nine attack at sight, one click out. That confirmed 9 and attack at sight. I bet you not one VIP is gonna be there. They're not gonna show. Oh, I think they'll be there, sir. It's important to them. 25 bucks says they're a no-show. You're on, sir. <laughs> I love your enthusiasm, shorty. <laughs> Fuck. You're gonna owe me 25 bucks, you realize that, don't you? I'm an optimist, sir. You're a fucking idiot, Shorty. Roger that, sir. Three Niner Alpha 66, six, I have convoy in sight on approach road. Over. Three Niner Alpha, white SUVs, confirm. 6-6, six, six, confirming three white SUVs, up armored. Over. Six, six, convoy has turned north off approach road, heading in direction of safe house. Over. A three Niner Alpha, acknowledged. Okay, everybody, we're on. BDK's going for it. The ghost and BDK will meet at the safe house, not at the ceremony site, so this is probably going to get personal. 
got that relay for me at ASIC. You're hooked up now, sir. Go ahead. Uh, one one Zulus, Golf Niner Whiskey, requesting cell phone trap at uh, Grid Quebec Quebec three six six nine or eight five three seven over. A Golf Niner Whiskey, this is one one Zulu. You're in luck. We got a high asset sitting on top of your grid marker. Running traps now. Niner Alpha 66 convoy has stopped over. Three Niner Alpha, Roger. Golf Niner Whiskey, 1 1 Zulu. We have a trap. Three signals. You want them all up? Uh, 1 1 Zulu, Golf Niner Whiskey, negative. Can you just feed them to us one by one? Over. What are you doing? Uh, he's turning their cell phones into listening devices, but don't ask me how. I have no idea. <laughs> 1 1 Zulu, first trap coming at you. Hello. Uh, 1 1 Zulu Golf Niner Whiskey negative. You can drop that trap over. 1 1 Zulu, good copy. Number two coming at you. Dura sade, ne prito sade. Kalama sade kewala kanu. Sokta na unapuri. 1 1 Zulu Golf Niner Whiskey, that's our guy. Call sign Bravo Delta Kilo, that's BDK. Thanks for your help. Out. Three nine or Alpha six six. Front door is opening. Call sign Ghost is stepping out. Call sign Ghost is alone. He shouldn't be alone. He should have guys with him. So what does that mean? So Ghost says that Bashir has insulted the honor of his family. For a young man, a former student, this is a great sin. Abdul says that his son Abdul owed him 5,000 US dollars. The ghost says he has just given him 5,000 US dollars. And says this will satisfy the question of the money. The ghost says yes. But the debt is not yet resolved. He wants his grandchildren, the little girls that were taken. He wants them returned. But she says this is impossible. The girls are gone, and the ghost should know this. This is so fucked up. Copy that. The Mazui Hamid. Barun Rasevrakda. I had to pay a chertada. Bashir says that his son Hamid is missing. What, his son? How the fuck did I not have this intel? Uh, Bashir is angry. He says he wants his son returned to him. He says that he wants to see his son. The ghost says, and so you shall. Jesus, 3 9 around for 6 6. I have a head, a human fucking head lying on the ground. Fuck. It's the sun. Call sign Hotel Whiskey Kilo. Shit, shit, shit. BDK is gonna react. Okay, look, they, they must not engage. 6 6 3 9 or Alpha, what is BDK doing? Do you have hostile intent? We got a weapon. 6-6, six, six, call sign Bravo Delta Kilo has a weapon. Hostile intent towards Civ, call sign Ghost. Fucking light him up. 6-6, six, six, Golf Niner Whiskey, do not take that shot. He has clearance. I'm overriding. 6-6, six, six, Golf Niner Whiskey, you don't understand. 6-6, six, six, I understand. Imminent threat. Hit him for fuck's sakes. Am engaging. Wait out. Confirm your dope. Up 23. Right, two. Roger. Six, six. Golf Niner Whiskey, Ryan, please do not take that he shot. He has intent. He doesn't need your okay. Stand by. Ryan, please don't do this. This is how Badal works. This is what the ghost wants. Send it. Ryan, please.
Good hit. Filling now, all birds in escort. Six six golf nine or whiskey. You got any idea what you just done? Six six, yeah, I think I do. I had imminent threat toward a civilian. I intervened. Yeah, you did intervene, six six, and you intervened in something you know nothing about. Back off, Mitchell. Six six three nine or alpha. Continue to rendezvous. You just fucked them. You fight your war, Captain. I'll fight mine. Six six golf nine and whiskey. Call sign ghost was seeking an honorable death, and you you just you took it away from him. You saved his life. It wasn't yours to save. Now he's got nothing. You understand that? He has nothing. That's enough, Captain. This is my CP. You will back off. Salam alaikum. What you doing? I don't know. You think you we just saved his bacon? I think it might be more complicated than that. How? What could possibly? Fuck! 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 Where the fuck did they come from? Guys from the safe house must have come for backup. I got five to ten on the run! Oh, Travis! Fuck! Heck, you shut the classifieds! Three nine out for six six contact. Multiple insurgents. One time CSA vital signs absent. We have a tech troops in contact. I got 15 and 20 moving over here. Taking effective fire on both flanks. Three nine or Alpha, Roger. How many insurgents? Over. Fuck. Six six two zero to three zero hostiles. Where the fuck they come from? How far away are the birds? Now they're at least 30 minutes out. They move back to Exfil nine and enter attack. Okay, uh, get under the talk. Get a QRF rolling out of Mass and Gar. I'm trying to break contact. Open the great pot. I'll jump one from there. Over. Three nine or Alpha, Roger. We're pushing for air and QRF, but you're gonna have to hang in there. Come on! Come on! Come on! Six six. Be advised. We have a civilian under our protection. Call sign Ghost. What the fuck? Oh, we gotta leave him. Never! Let's go! Come on! Come on! Come on! Come on!
Between on and off, this is 6-6. Six, six. I'm sorry. We're strong pointing from Grey Punch. We're running low on ammo. Take We're it. being surrounded. What's your QRF status? Uh, 3-9 or Alpha. QRF is 1-5. Mike's out. You gotta hang in there. Don't let him take us alive, please. Jesus, don't let him get a fucking skill of... Badal? We've got a UEV above them now, ma'am. Okay, put it up. On screen. Oh my god. There's dozens of them. 6-6, six, six, three nine or alpha. Sit rep, please. Three nine or alpha, six six. Multiple insurgents in force on all points. I'm requesting fire mission. The grid Quebec, Quebec. Three three one two eight nine seven six. No, Ryan, no, you are danger close. Golf for Romeo, this is six six. No, Ryan, it's right on top of you. Gonna take out everybody, including himself. Six six, golf four, Romeo sent. No, golf four, Romeo three nine or alpha, override fire mission. Six six. Authorized, danger close. Fire for effect, Quebec, Quebec, three three one two eight nine seven six. Golf four, Romeo. Fire mission up. 3-9 or Alpha, rescind a fire order. Cancel fire order grid, Quebec, Quebec. 3-9 or Alpha, please, Jesus, Ryan, don't do this. Please don't do this. 6-6, six, six, authorized. Quebec, Quebec, I'm gonna be a father. You understand? You even understand what I'm trying to say? The dear Kuro Jango, what tell him? Horsale for Jim, two or three resume, they will get at one series of the Fadia Fakarko. For this is six six. Three nine or alpha acknowledge. Six six, I'm sorry, baby.
So who is it that gave you this tip? My uncle. Really? Is every single adult male in Afghanistan your uncle? Yes. Amazing. I'm going to Kabul for a while. See your family? Kandahar is a bit crazy right now. Yeah. I'll be safe. Call me when you're back. Fuck, I'm gonna be late. This man, Ryan, he was your friend. Yeah. Yeah, he was. I don't have too many friends here. You have me. I'm your friend. Yeah, you are. Alexander the Great fought a counterinsurgency in Afghanistan that lasted almost three years. And by the end of those years, he was drinking heavily and completely paranoid. One night, he got into a row with a guy named Cletus the Black, a loyal friend. Cletus accused him of certain things, and Alexander threw a spear into his heart. As he watched his friend die, he lost his mind. Five years later, Alexander was dead. As the Afghans say, you might have the clocks, but we've got the time. <laughs> 